matters. But then now away from matters uh, sports, and Kenya has come from a long way with TB, from stigma to people being jailed for not taking their TB medication. And when the COVID-19 pandemic struck, the situation became worse from missed diagnosis, a drug-resistant TB and deaths. Deaths which remain far higher than those from COVID-19. A family in Meru County and another in Nandi understands too well the burden of TB. Our health and science reporter Sada Hassan has more. A grave welcomes you as you step into the homestead of Nyambura. A bitter reminder of how TB ravaged this family of six, from one sibling to the parent, all got the infection. The two children lost two years of school when they were on medication, and upon getting back, they faced stigma. Carol McKenna, a clinician handling tuberculosis in Tigania East, has been following up on this family since the first two cases were diagnosed. These two children, at some point, because of missing of treatment, they also uh, progressed to pre-XDR TB. Monica Nyambura, their mother, had showed no symptoms of TB, but upon X-ray, it was suggestive and immediately put on medication. However, has just like her children was resistant to some of the drugs. It was after the complete treatment in September, in October. Unfortunately, we lost the mother. Shule uwa tunapas boa, but atuno yom tuwa kutulipia atas kulufis. 21-year-old Patrick is now a father, mother, and a guardian all rolled into one. For Patrick, Munene, and Makena, some days can be really hard, but they are glad that they have won one battle, the fight against tuberculosis. In Nandi County, Daniel Ngitich, whose story is quoted as one of the milestones in addressing TB in Kenya, after being sentenced to six months in prison for defaulting on TB treatment in 2010. Until one day, the area chief, accompanied with other officials, appeared at his doorstep accusing him of failing to follow up with his medication. We need more education on TB, TB how it is transmitted. Anne Rono, a Kelian representative in Nandi County, says that stigma drove people away from Daniel and his co-accused. So we are educating our people that when they are there to their drugs, they will be treated. According to Eunice Kanana, Meru County TB coordinator, in 2010, there was a slight drop in the disease burden compared to 2019. Drug-resistant TB, we are still on the higher side with around 73 patients. We continue to empower clinicians and patients to ensure that they are able to complete their treatment and successfully uh, get cured for tuberculosis. In Kenya, 32,000 people died of TB in 2019, while 140,000 people fell ill. 56,000 people were not notified nor diagnosed. Saad Hassan, KT News. All right, and an acute shortage of antiretroviral drugs has hit the country, exposing people living with HIV to an uncertain